This is our city tour of Verado. Verado Village, affiliated with Buckeye. Who knew something so nice was in Buckeye? When I lived in Avondale, and I thought of Buckeye, it was not that nice, trust me. This is pretty cool, what'd you say, Gabby? So I love it here. This is called Main Street on Verado. So this is pretty much where you have like your shops, you know, you have um, little places to eat, like the pizzeria. You have the wine bar here, coffee shops. Um, you have fine wines. And that little area over there, that little area is where they have like the community events. You're gonna get hit. Just. <laughs> They have the community events during like the winter, Easter, and all that event. That's where the whole Verado community gets together and, you know, enjoy that, the neighborhood. And that was where that fancy fountain was. Mm -hmm. All right. Sounds like you know a lot about Verado. I mean, I live very close to it. So. All right. This is my very, very first time in Verado. Mine as well. It's beautiful. You guys should come out here more often. <laughs> we might move out here. Who knows? It's nice. It's nice. So this is a Chow Gracie Pizzeria. All right, so that might have some good pizza. I'll be the judge of that. Fresh produce. So what is this? Uh, your grocery like, store? I mean, like, out of, like, the same. So, it's so close. Like, it's so just, like, everything's crazy. Another pizza real place. This is Pizza Kitchen over there. See? Yeah. See? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pizza Kitchen. This is your I believe this is, what is that? Like a natural grocery store? This is, um, Bashes. Bashes. This is your fancy Bashes. Yeah. Yeah, and right across the street, that is, he just pointed out, that's a golf club. Oh, way down there is the golf club. Mm -hmm. It's a very small town. That's why it's, okay, so you like could the, literally walk everything. And then outside of this central is all the neighborhoods and all the homes. I don't know what it is. Cars just want to hit me today. Like as I was driving, I almost saw two accidents in front of me. If you notice all the plates, like Washington, oh. Colorado. That's, that's Colorado, that's right. And that was Washington, right? Behind is Idaho. Idaho. Look at all these different license yeah, plates, yeah. guys. It's because a lot of people are moving to Arizona. You see that all the time. It's growing so rapidly. Plus, we're such a beautiful state, so a lot of people, the snowbirds, buy vacation homes here, and they live here, you know, half time of the year, and then the other, they go back home. Especially look, when the weather is this good. And look, some people actually have their golf carts over here. Straight from the golf course, that's pretty cool. We got CBS. Oh, that's a fancy CVS. Look at that. <laughs> fancy. There's also a 55 and over community here in Verado, and it's strictly 55 and over, and it's a beautiful community. So those of you who are open to those type of neighborhoods, you might want to check it out. Now, what's the deal with 55 and over communities? Um, well, it's strictly one person in the household has to be 55 and older in those communities. It's more of a... Um, retirement community so there's a lot of just an adult community it's yeah. just an adult community now is there like an extra hoa for that how's that work uh it depends it depends on the community yeah yeah, yeah most of the time it's um you have your hoa but then they offer exclusive pricing for the golf memberships so depending on how how often you golf if you're a big golfer you know they have those kind of premium memberships for those. yeah and if you love golf verona has one of the largest golf courses in, in the phoenix area yeah, one of the yeah. top golf courses. Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. How many holes, Janet? 36. 36, yeah. Yeah, like you guys, legitimately, like, like a legitimate 36, line. wow. Yeah, it's one of the, they actually have real competitions in this golf course. Wow. So. That's awesome. Yeah. Now, do you guys golf? Uh, I do. I want to go to this, this golf community over here. I haven't seen that one before. <laughs> I put, put. <laughs> so this right here is Verado Way. When you get off the highway, it takes you right on to Verado Way. And you got all these fancy trees. So is this, would you say this is like the center of town over here? Yeah, this is the main part of town. So main is, Street. Yeah, you'll find your pharmacy here, your grocery stores here, you know, everything. Workout facilities, here. dental, medical. But that's it, this is one street. This, is there anything more to it? This There's is it. More, a lot more over there. If you want to hop in your car, we can probably drive about a mile down. And that's where you have your dental offices, gas stations, more restaurants, the coffee, mm -hmm. Verado coffee shop. Yeah, There's let's check lot. out Verado coffee. You and got me wanting to see it. <laughs> we should totally it's go good. in there. It's super cute. Verado is it's a very exclusive and unique neighborhood, um, which is why it's like a city of its own. It, it really is. So there's yeah. a lot to see. You want to go check it out? Yeah, definitely. Right. Should we um, drive by the golf course right now? Just so you can yeah. see it. Okay. And let's then we can it. go over there. 
All right, let's check out the golf course and go over there. Oh, yeah. All right, I don't see anyone behind me. Son of a bum. All right. Don't hit me, Lewis. All right, there we go. All right, this is a rental. Don't hit me. Here we go. And we're gonna go see if we could check out the golf course while we're here. Gabby seems to really like this area. Very pretty. Don't get me wrong, it's really nice. Village Commons. All right, Janet, you're going the right way. <laughs> you're not gonna bust your chops about that for a while. I'm notorious for not following rules, so. Now, this is really pretty, guys. This really does remind me of San Diego. Morado Golf Club. Fancy. See people walking their dogs. I'm mad at my dog, Rocco. He peed on the sofa three times this week. Three times. He's not allowed on the sofa anymore. And this morning, he did it out of spite. It's not that he's old. He jumped on the sofa and peed right in front of me. I'm so mad at him. And I'm sure we're gonna see the golf course from here. Oh yeah, I see some of it. Oh yeah, there's a hole right there. This is really pretty, I'm not gonna lie. I think this is prettier than Gilbert. This is really nice. You know, people that told me Verado was nice, I had no idea. Now, it's still on the west side, which I refer to as tumbleweed. But this is nice tumbleweed. I would live here. I don't know other than that little bash is what else they got in town. But, uh, and CVS. Well, with everybody ordering stuff on Amazon, does it really matter all that much, you know? Look at that house. They're building a big house right there. Another big house. Look at that one over there. Big house they're building. I gotta be careful, I don't wanna hit these cars. Where did, holy crap! <laughs> We're going off-roading, guys! <laughs> Are we purposely going here? <laughs> no parking this side. It says no parking this side, guys. <laughs> oh, Gabby's driving. I'm gonna make fun of Gabby now. <laughs> I just wanted to show you that all this, my pointer, is hiking. Oh, okay, let me get out of the car. So this, we used to have access to this um, parkway. It was more um, for you can to park and walk, but now they bought those out and now there's nothing but custom homes. So those are like million dollar custom homes. Wow. But on your backyard, you have um, hiking trails. Hiking trails, okay. <laughs> what, what, is what is this hiking trail called? White Mountain? White, White Tank Mountains. White Tank Mountains. Uh -huh. White, what? White Tanks. White Tanks? Tanks. White tanks. tanks. It's part of it. White okay. tanks? Mm -hmm. Like military tanks? Uh -huh. yes. White tanks, tanks oh, yeah. mountain. Yeah, you can actually see the valley from here. Kind of oh, yeah, look at that. You can, you can see the valley. I don't know if you, Zonies can see that. Yeah, and that's a golf course right there, too. All that. That's good part of the nice. Golf yeah, so people come up here in the morning and they come hiking, you know? It's really perfect of living in this kind of community. You, you have everything so central to you and you have outdoors literally at your backyard and for the record it was gabby that was driving it says no parking this side it was gabby <laughs> not janet this time <laughs> just so you can get used to a typical arizona driver <laughs> 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 rules don't apply <laughs> I know a few of you Zonies are from Miami, and so you owe her an apology because she was scared. Because <laughs> you guys don't know how to drive, apparently. Yeah, they had nobody would use their signals. People. Why would you give away your secret plan? <laughs> Zero Signal. Patience. 
everywhere I would go, they would like <laughs> honk at me. It was crazy. I'm like, I miss Arizona. <laughs> and they say Arizona drivers are bad. Uh-uh, not at all. <laughs> Now let me ask you a question about Verado, because you should be part of what we're going to go see for a little city tour video. Mm -hmm. Is there like a Costco here, like any major stores? It's about 10 miles from here. Yeah. All right, so yeah, it's not so far. So the freeway is just right off Verado. Oh, yeah. You can take the 10. It would probably be like a 10 or 15 minute drive to get there. Yeah. Okay. But you have your bashes. <laughs> Bashes is one of our big chain stores here, kind of like Safeway. Uh, back at home, we had A&P, you know. So over here, they got what they call Bashes. Now, you got to say Basher, because there was this guy by the name of Eddie Basher, and he was on TV all the time. I used to call it Bashas, and I got corrected. It's Bashes. <laughs> I kind of like Bashes better. We're heading towards Verado Coffee. No, I do not own a dash cam, okay? You guys are gonna complain about it you can send me one all right lots and lots of palm trees here heritage swim park i saw the sign in full oh that's the fire department over there on my right that's the fire department look how pretty this is guys very nice, all the trees, landscaping. Everything looks brand new here. And you're not too far away from like uh, Avondale and Goodyear. You're still in that basic vicinity. All right, we're turning left apparently. Ooh, look at that. That is fancy. Barato Coffee Company. Yeah, I was by here this morning actually. I didn't realize that was the Barato Coffee Company. That looks pretty cool. And I see a Verizon and Starbucks. Look, there's cacti. I assume there's parking back here. Oh, a little dog park, how cute. You see how that works? There's two gates. You go through the first gate and then the second gate. Uh-oh. Guys, the popo -po is here. I gotta be on my best behavior. So there, there's your charging station. Oh, if you have one of them fancy Teslas, you could just charge right there. And that is your Verado Coffee Company. Verado Coffee Company. Mm -hmm. Really cool. There's also um, a travel info center there, meaning that you can get a lot of information about Verado there, but if you're looking, just call us. We'll get you that information for you. Cool. And the Very coffee nice. you said was good, right? Oh, oh yeah. I'm going to go back in there before we leave, actually. Want to go in there now? <laughs> just to film a little bit? Before, before yeah, we sure. Leave. Let's go yeah. check it out. It's, it's very aesthetically pleasing to look at. Aesthetically pleasing to look at. <laughs> I have a client that's buying a house there. And they love it. And it says it's, it, it reminds them of Chicago because they're from Chicago. And... They're buying right over there. You hear that, Chicagoans? You could buy a house right across the street from the Verado Coffee Place. <laughs> Mountain, sunshine, way to go. Look at a fancy sign, Verado Info Center. So that's weird. So this is separate than the coffee shop, I assume. Yeah, right? Let's go okay. Yeah, just a little tip. If you do come visit Verado, you want to make sure that you're here to visit Verado and not tell the residents that you're visiting Buckeye, because they're Verado, not Buckeye. <laughs> so like I said, Buckeye's ghetto. <laughs> we are at Verado Coffee Company. I just got permission from this guy to record. And look, this is really fancy, this is nice. This is really nice. Who knew this existed within Buckeye? And look, in case they run out of cups, you've got a cup up there. So you go. Look at that. Fancy. They have a little workstation that you can come and chill at in that little corner over here. All of this, you can just come, work, hang out, drink some coffee. It's part of the little coffee place. Oh, I'm going to check that out. Oh, this is the entrance to that info center thing, so it is all connected. 
and here for kids to play. This looks like, oh, this is like the city over here. What was that? What do you want to drink? Oh, I'm good. I'm fully caffeinated. Thank you. No, I'm positive. Thank you. I got tons of water. Thank you. I'm good. Thank you. There's Culver's, so there's fast food places. Or they're trying to build more and bring those into here. All the amenities that you're, you have, you have playgrounds, exercise stations, volleyball courts, basketball, nice. hiking paths. 21 plus miles of paths and trails. So like the cool thing is that like for those of you who are really active, this is a very active community. You know, there's a lot of bike trails for those of you that love to cycle and do those kind of bike trails. There's tons of them here. There's a lot of people that have things in common. So there, you know, you'll meet people that have the same interests as you. If you like to be active, this is a community for you. So Gabby found us this map over here. So yep. to point out, where are we? We are right here. Our closest hospital is right here. What's that called? Banner Health Center and Abrazo Buckeye Medical Center. We have a library. This is um, the White Tank Mountains. Oh my gosh, we have a really cool library in there. It's like 30 minutes away from here. There's a library at the White Tank Mountains. It's so cool. You literally, it's all windows. You can just study there because I used to study there. And you know, next you know, coyotes would be passing by out outdoors, and you can see that it's a unique experience. Coyotes, I don't want to be studying near coyotes. <laughs> the glass will protect me. The glass will protect me. Oh, that's that. Thank you, that sets me at ease. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> here is um, you have A plus schools in this district, A rated schools. You have the golf courses, golf courses, another A rated school. This is where we were at the Victory Club, so we were at. Um, where Main Street was. If you take the 10 freeway, which is right next to the coffee place, mm -hmm. you're gonna be entering Goodyear and Litchfield Park and Tolleson. This is just pretty much how we expand this way. Look what I um, show you guys along something. Little facts about Barada. Facts about Barada. We're learning stuff here. So, like this is really cute. It has 78 parks. 78 parks? It has two um, golf courses. Okay. Um, it has 20,000 trees. Two, two Tom Lehman golf courses. Well, who's Tom Lehman? I don't know. I don't know who Tom Lehman yeah, I don't is. Know so. I don't know a lot about golf, but there's over 20,000 trees in Marauder. 20,000 trees? But I obviously can't do the uh, outro here because I'll get kicked out <laughs> and the police will come get me. We drove by um, by the fire station. I saw that, yeah. Isn't it cute? It was very nice. That Starbucks is less than a month old, by the way. That Starbucks is less than a month old. All right, this is nice. It has there a... you have it. That's beautiful Verado. Honestly, one of the best, one of the cutest cities that I've ever seen. This is by far one of my favorites. So that concludes another edition of Arizona Living. Be sure to like, subscribe, and let us know below what do you guys think about Verado? Is it something that will interest you? Till next time. Bye guys. Bye guys.